Hello Aquarius, welcome to your weekly reading. So we're going to look at messages for the month of October. These messages are general, so whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages can resonate the most. They're also, I was going to say timeless, but it's for October. I don't know, Spirit gave me timeless for some of you. Something deals with time. Something could deal with you waiting on um, something for a while now, Aquarius. And it's finally coming in for you in the month of October. But let's go ahead and tap in. I have your spiritual energy, love, as well as career. So for your spiritual energy, we have potential, freedom, and abundance. So let's go ahead and see what this energy is for you. Spirit, tell me why it's potential, freedom, and abundance here for Aquarius. What's the message? Why is potential, freedom, and abundance here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is potential, freedom, and abundance here? I have the Page of Swords and I have the Fool, both in the reverse. So somebody's not getting good news. I feel like somebody's stuck or Aquarius, you feel stuck. This is your energy on the Fool. Somebody's not able to move forward. There's no progress being made. Give me an energy for the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords in the reverse here for Aquarius? What's the message? Why is the Page of Swords here for Aquarius? What's the energy spirit? The world in the reverse. This is giving me, even though it's in the reverse, it's giving me like an opportunity is over. I feel like somebody kept doing something repetitively. For some of you, this is negative talk. This is gossip. Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius energy on the world. Tell me more about the Page of Wands in the reverse. I have the Ten of Swords and the Seven of Swords. Yeah, so somebody lied on you, Aquarius. So this could be going on with somebody um, in this Page of Wands in the reverse energy. Somebody who's a liar, manipulator, somebody who betrayed you. And they kept doing it. And for some of you, this person is still trying to do it, but it's not working. Um, this person is in this fool in the reverse energy. It's like their life is stagnated because of whatever energy they put out towards you. This is somebody who wanted you stuck, stagnated, who didn't want you to have anything good, who didn't want you to be able to move forward. Why is the world here? Something could be happening online. Somebody could be trying to take somebody's image here publicly. Why is the world in the reverse here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the world in the reverse here? I have the three of wands in the reverse and strength. Yeah, somebody was determined to delay you or block you all together. Somebody did not want you to make any type of progress, Aquarius. This person could have Leo highly aspected. Why is the seven of swords here? And this person did this continuously. Like somebody didn't know how to stop. The world in the reverse. Somebody just kept going. Why is the seven of swords here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the seven of swords in the reverse here? What is the message? The page of pentacles. It's like something new. Somebody was always coming up with some type of new lie, new information on you that was false to tell people. I'm telling you, somebody was literally betraying you. Give me an energy for the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? For some of you, like if you're a content creator, this is somebody who don't want other people to collaborate with you. Why is the Ten of Swords here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the Ten of Swords here for Aquarius? What's the message, Spirit? Why is the Ten of Swords here? The Two of Pentacles. Yeah, this person has been doing this for some time. Like somebody has been doing this repetitively over and over. Been trying to keep this up. 
keep these lies up. Block your forward movement. Give me an energy for the full in reverse. But I'm hearing like something is a waste. Something is a waste of time. It's a waste of effort. It's a waste of energy. And this person is about to see this in October. Why is the full in the reverse here for Aquarius? Why is the full in the reverse here for Aquarius? What's the energy spirit? Why is this here? Messages for Aquarius. Six of Pentacles. So this person is getting back what they deserve in the month of October. So where they wanted you blocked and stuck, delayed, that's going to be their energy. Somebody's getting their energy back. That's all. Whatever they've been doing, the lies, the manipulation, trying to taint your image, is all coming back to this person. I'm hearing people. For some of you, this could have been multiple people. Why is the fool in the reverse here? Or Aquarius, what's the energy for some of you? This could even be um, someone or people in your family. Give me an energy for the fool in the reverse. There could have been like some type of argument that ensued. Five of Swords and a Magician. This person is not going to be able to manifest. I don't care how much effort and energy this person puts into something. It's not going to work. This person is not going to be able to have a new beginning to start over. Somebody is stuck right where they are and that is karma. That is justice. And they're going to be highly frustrated. And I feel like also somebody could have paid for something. Somebody could have paid to have you stagnant. And this person is wondering why it's not working. It's because it's not meant to. It is working, but not on you. It's working on them. And they're about to see that. Yeah, for some of you, somebody could be into dark energy manipulation. Something's not working. And the more this person does... the more they delay themselves. The more stagnation they create for themselves. Give me an energy for the Six of Pentacles. Why is the Six of Pentacles here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the Six of Pentacles here for Aquarius? What's the message spirit? The lovers. So for some of you, this has to do with a relationship. That somebody chose to invest in. Somebody had a choice. Whether this is somebody choosing to talk about you, lie on you over and over again. Or somebody having a choice in terms of who they chose to partner up with. But where this is about a relationship... Whoever this person chose to partner up with Aquarius, just know things are not going right over there. Somebody's frustrated. They're not able to manifest anything they want. They feel stuck. Somebody chose to give to the wrong situation and they could see it. I feel like with this freedom, somebody wants to release. Somebody's ready to walk away and leave it all behind. Heavy Gemini energy. Give me a message for the Five of Swords. Why is the Five of Swords here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the Five of Swords here for Aquarius? What's the message spirit? The Queen of Cups. So this person now wants to heal a relationship with you, a connection with you. For some of you, this could be somebody you have a child with. For some of you, this person is trying to manifest you back, but it's not working. Give me an energy for the Magician. I feel like for some of you too, whoever this person is that you were romantically involved with, this is somebody who was talking negatively about you. This person could have been speaking reckless to family members and friends, trying to taint your image, trying to make you look like you were the issue in the relationship or the bad parent in the situation. And now they need you. They want you to come back. But it's like, no, they're blocked from your energy. Tell me more about the magician in the reverse. 
Why is the magician in reverse here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the magician in the reverse here for Aquarius? What's the energy spirit? Why is the magician in the reverse here? What's the energy? The sun. Oh, yeah, somebody miserable. Somebody is miserable. They're unhappy. But this is what they manifested for themselves. I feel like, you know, you're over here in this very healing energy. You're the queen of cups. You're loving yourself to the lovers. You're very balanced. And somebody's unhappy. For some of you, this is somebody who's unhappy because you're happy. They wanted you to be in this sun in the reverse energy, but it's them. Give me an energy for potential. Why is potential here for Aquarius? For some of you, something could be happening by the threes in the month of October because all three of these cards flipped out at the same time, Aquarius. I have the four wands. You're going to um, be in a relationship where somebody does see your potential. I feel like the potential for happiness... When it comes to your Aquarius, it's limitless. I feel like you're free from this person. They're blocked from you. I feel like for some of you where this person has been lying on you, it's falling on deaf ears. People don't even listen to this energy anymore. Give me a message for freedom. For some of you too, I'm getting like you could have been having issues with um, a masculine's mom. And for some of you, this is somebody you have a child with. I feel like the mother of this masculine has been speaking like reckless on your name. But she has only proven that she's the real issue and not you. And people are starting to see this. So this is giving me the energy of vindication, Aquarius. Whatever she claims, you're being vindicated. Give me an energy for freedom. Why is freedom here for Aquarius? What's the energy? I'm hearing Faith Evans. I love you. This person wants to tell you that they love you. Or now somebody's realizing they love you. The Two of Cups and the Queen of Wands. I feel like you're free from a karmic partnership where there was no love. For some of you, there could have been third-party interference. But you're walking away. You're distancing yourself. For some of you, too, this is somebody choosing to distance themselves from a third party. The other person they chose. Because they're realizing somebody isn't their wish fulfillment in the month of October. Somebody saw potential in this person, in the situation, but now they're realizing there isn't any, there never was. Somebody was blinded from the truth. Give me an energy for abundance. Why is abundance here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is abundance here for Aquarius? What's the message spirit? The Nine of Pentacles. So listen. Sagittarius energy, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius, your energy on the wheel. Heavy energy for you out here in this portion, Aquarius. You're about to level up. I feel like for some of you too, this could have been somebody who wanted to treat you like a third party. But wasn't really offering you anything. Wasn't offering you a serious commitment. Somebody lied to you here. They did not have genuine intentions. But you get to sail off into the sunset. You're going to be in this nine of pentacles, will of fortune energy. So things are going to be looking up for you when it comes to your stability. I'm hearing the gospel song, the sky is the limit. So literally Aquarius, the sky is the limit to what you can have in the month of October. If you could envision it, if you could dream it, if you could believe it, then you can have it. Somebody's luck is about to change here. Especially when it comes to your stability. You're coming into a very abundant and prosperous time in your life. And I'm hearing free from somebody's antics. So somebody definitely tried to create some type of drama. Cause a delay in your life. But that's over. That's done with. Somebody tried to limit your potential. 
And for some of you, this is somebody who didn't see your potential. But either way, you're about to level up and move right past this confusion, the manipulation. So let's go on to your love energy. We have forgiveness. Forgiving yourself or another will help you move forward. So spirit, give me an energy for forgiveness. Why is a forgiveness here for Aquarius? Love energy. What's the message? Why is forgiveness here for Aquarius love energy? What's the message, spirit? Why is forgiveness here? The fool. Tell me more. Aquarius, you're heavy out here. Give me another energy. Okay. I have the Ten of Cups and the Four of Cups. I feel like somebody's accepting that whatever relationship they're in just isn't wish fulfillment. Yeah, this is the energy of acceptance. I feel like once somebody was in the energy of just not wanting to see it. But in the month of October, somebody's going to be in the full energy. Somebody's taking a leap forward and not looking back. Give me energy for the full. Why is the full here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the fool here for Aquarius? What's the energy spirit? The devil in the reverse. Somebody's leaving a karmic relationship. Somebody could be walking away from a Capricorn or somebody that has a highly aspected. Yeah, something just wasn't a good fit. Someone's not balanced at all. They're toxic. Give me an energy for the Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here? I feel like, too, for some of you, you could have been trying to keep things hidden from, like, family and friends when it came to this partnership. Like, you didn't want people to know just what you were going through with this person, how miserable you are. Somebody could actually have a substance abuse problem. Give me an energy for the Ten of Cups in the reverse. Why is the Ten of Cups in the reverse here for Aquarius? What's the energy? The Page of Cups and the Queen of Swords. Yeah, this is somebody who's a liar. This person comes in. For some of you, I'm hearing whenever you're about to leave. So I feel like you've tried to walk away on multiple occasions. But somebody comes in. They apologize to you. They sell you a dream. They lie to you just to get you to stay, to accept them back. I'm also getting for some of you, you may have been um, in fear of this person. You may have been fearful that this person would retaliate if you were to leave, but somebody's taking back their power here. Yeah, somebody would just lie. For some of you too, you could be finding out that somebody has been lying about a child. And I'm hearing a pregnancy for some of you. But it's like whenever this lie is revealed, whenever this deception comes out, somebody's walking away from this family dynamic. For some of you too, somebody could have been like um, very traditional. That's why they stayed. That's why they tried to make this marriage or this connection work. For some of you, somebody could have stayed in something due to a child that they're going to be finding out isn't there. Somebody lied about a kid here. And the truth is being revealed in the month of October. Give me energy for the Page of Cups. Why is the Page of Cups here? The King of Wands. Wow. So for some of you, you're going to be finding out that whoever this masculine energy is fathered a child. Somebody could have been saying, oh, I didn't have any dealings with that person. We never had intimate interactions. But no, this person is low vibrational, very karmic. Somebody's a player. They like to get around. And somebody's going to be finding out that whoever they're with actually fathered a child outside of the connection. Either way, whatever you find out in the month of October is going to put you in this energy of the fool where you are leaping in an entirely new direction. Give me an energy for the four of cups. It's like you're just going to accept it as facts and you're moving on. You're no longer going to try to hold on to a relationship that you're not even happy in. Like it's not even blissful. <laughs> I feel like somebody miserable. Ten of cups in the reverse. No emotional fulfillment whatsoever. I feel like somebody was just hanging on to something. That wasn't really for them. 
somebody was hanging on to a dead situation literally something bent over or sore somebody stresses you out Give me another energy for the Four of Cups. The so number four could be significant. We have the Four of Cups, Four of Swords, so 44. Tell me more about the Four of Cups. Why is the Four of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the Four of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the message spirit? Knight of Wands. Yeah, so... Whoever this king of wands in reverse is, this person is stressed out because they were operating in some very karmic energy. And for some of you, a child is now in the mix. Um, this person is going to have no other choice but to accept this child. You know, you made your bed, you have to lie in it. For some of you, though, what I'm getting is... This masculine energy wants you to accept this child as well. Like somebody wants you to accept a child that was created outside of your relationship. And you're not doing that. You're going to move on. You're going to leave this person behind. Give me an energy for forgiveness. Why is forgiveness here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is forgiveness here for Aquarius? What's the message spirit? The Eight of Pentacles and the Hermit. Somebody was dealing with someone that they work with for some of you. They had a secret relationship. So this is somebody who will stay late or saying that they were staying late, but they were actually... Um, connecting with somebody else. I feel like whatever you've been through with this person has made you wiser. And it's made you work on yourself. Somebody's working on themselves or you will be. You'll be healing. Somebody's becoming aligned here. I feel like with this forgiveness... You're just going to let bygones be bygones. I don't see you holding a grudge because you're going to be looking at the situation from a higher perspective. You weren't happy anyway, and you're finally going to be able to move on. Whether somebody's finding out that a kid isn't theirs or that, you know, whoever they're with fathered a child outside of the connection. Somebody is just very wise. They look at things differently. You're going to see this as a new beginning. Not that it's, you know, not going to hurt or not going to bother you. But in the totality of the entire situation, you weren't happy in this relationship anyway. So this is God. This is Spirit giving you your walking paper, saying that you're free. Um, I feel like for others of you... You may not, you know, be in the energy of forgiveness initially, but the more you continue to work on yourself, the more enlightened you become, like over time, you will be able to forgive this person. Now, for some of you, this has already happened. And what I'm getting is you're finally going to be able to forgive, genuinely forgive this person in the month of October because you've done so much healing and so much work on yourself that you can finally release the past and move on. You may have released this person physically, but you were still holding on to them energetically because you were holding a grudge because you were still hurt. That's fading. That's going away. You can officially be in this full energy and move on entirely emotionally and mentally from whatever transpired in this connection and i feel like too you're going to be forgiving yourself for the choices that you have made i also feel like for some of you like this masculine is going to be working on himself as well He's also going to be working on forgiving himself for being in this Knight of Wands energy. Like somebody's ways have just finally caught up to them. And they're stressed out about it. 
but someone had to learn the hard way here. It's like somebody's going to have to forgive themselves for the type of energy they were putting out. The behavior they were displaying. I feel like over time, this person is going to realize that, you know what? I was real toxic. I wasn't in the right energy. I wasn't deserving of a Ten of Cups. Because I wasn't investing in that. I was investing in something else that wasn't for my highest good. I feel like over time, this masculine energy, this king of wands in the reverse is going to awaken. I feel like for some of you, this person been a player ever since they were a teenager and never stopped. But now that this change is happening, somebody's going to wake up here. So let's move on to your career. Now for your career, we have distant horizons in the reverse. So the number nine, the number 36, the number 63 could all be relevant. So let's go ahead and pull some energy on that. Give me some messages for distant horizon. Why is distant horizons in the reverse here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is distant horizons here for Aquarius? What's the energy spirit? Why is distant horizons here for Aquarius? The two of cups, tell me more. Page of Cups, King of Wands. So for some of you, where you've been waiting on like some type of partnership to come in for you, um, somebody could have their own business here. It's coming in in the month of October. I feel like somebody's going to be super friendly too. Yeah, you're about getting ready to work with somebody, Aquarius. For some of you too, I, I see you um, starting a new job or what I'm getting is there's somebody else who's going to be a new person at your company and you and this person are going to be a great fit. Somebody's a team player here. Whoever this person is, is very nice. They're very genuine, compassionate. Somebody's just very friendly. That's what I'm getting. Somebody is super friendly and you and this person are going to hit it off. I feel like this is somebody who pays a lot of t attention to details. I see you forming a very good partnership with whoever this is. This is definitely going to be a co-worker. Or for some of you, like I said, I'm picking up like on a business partner as well. Somebody wanting to collaborate with you. But somebody's super friendly. I just keep getting that energy. Somebody is real friendly, Aquarius. Give me an energy for the Two of Cups. Why is the Two of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the Two of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the message spirit? The chariot. So for some of you, I feel like you may have been trying to like go at something alone. And it hasn't fully been working out because there was somebody that you were destined to partner with. Thank you, Spirit. So you and this person are meant to work together. I feel like once you two cross paths, that's when things are going to move full force for you. When it comes to this business venture, give me an energy for the Two of Cups. Something that has to do with the Cancer for some of you. Why is the Two of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the energy? The Eight of Cups. Tell me more about the Eight of Cups. What's the message? The Eight of Wands. The number eight could be significant, 88. Give me one more. Give me something for the Chariot. What's the energy? The Nine of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords. For some of you, you may be finding out that somebody has been stealing money from you where you do have your own business. Somebody's being very deceptive here. This is somebody who wants um, 
all of the revenue for themselves. For some of you, this person's trying to get you to walk away. For some of you, you could do something online, have a platform, and somebody's trying to get you to walk away from your platform. But it's only because this person wants to be abundant. It's about greed. That's it. So somebody's trying to secretly sabotage you here, trying to sabotage your growth. Give me energy for the Knight of Wands. I mean, the King of Wands. Why is the King of Wands here? For Aquarius, what's the energy? The Eight of Swords. Tell me more about the King of Wands. The Tower. So for some of you, what I'm getting is there's going to be somebody coming in as if they have good intentions, but they don't. Somebody may come off as being really, really friendly. I'm getting that. Somebody's going to appear super friendly, Aquarius, but they're not. Somebody's coming to block you, stagnate you, hold you in place. And this is all over money. Somebody could be a Scorpio here. Give me an energy for the tower. So be mindful of who you partner with. Who you get advice from for some of you like something has to do with somebody not giving you the right advice somebody's trying to sabotage you here somebody wants whatever you're working on your business your platform to fail why is the tower here for aquarius what's the message why is the tower here for aquarius what's the energy spirit October messages. Judgment. Okay, so somebody's going to be going to jail. Something has to do with money. Somebody's been hoarding money. And I'm getting like reinvesting it. Something has to do with some type of financial crime here. Someone is having a tower moment in the month of October, and it's your judgment. So somebody came in and appeared like they had the best intentions for you, but they didn't. For some of you, too, somebody's lying about stealing money. Um... What I'm getting is somebody could work in a department store and you have an employee, a co-worker that has been lying about stealing money. Something has to do with a drawer or this is something that's going to transpire in the month of October. Just be mindful because somebody may come off as like they're all innocent. Like, no, I didn't do it. I would never do that. I'm hearing something about cameras. So you may definitely want to go check the cameras. Give me energy for the page of cups. Why is the Page of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is the Page of Cups here for Aquarius? What's the energy spirit? The Nine of Cups. Somebody's going to overdo it though. Somebody does too much. I feel like for some of you, you're going to know that this person is fake because they overdo it. This is giving me like a too good to be true energy. You're not going to trust this person anyway because you're going to feel like they're being fake why is the page of cups here what is the message why is the page of cups here for aquarius what's the energy for some of you too where this is like a co-worker this is somebody that will do something um and blame it on you so be mindful of who you're working around Make sure you dot your I's, cross your T's. Because somebody may try to set you up here to take the fall. Something deals with money. But when it's really them, Knight of Wands, somebody's very immature, very reckless, very greedy. For some of you too, this could be a younger energy or just somebody who's extremely immature. I'm hearing inexperienced. So for some of you, this could definitely be somebody that's younger. This could be, I'm hearing a teenager for some of you. Just be mindful of who you're working around. 
because I feel like there's definitely something underhanded going on here. It's somebody's job. Give me an energy for distant horizons in the reverse. The moon. Something's coming out. Something's been a long time coming. Aquarius. There's a secret here that is being revealed in the month of October. Something that had to do with the Cancer or Pisces. Tell me more about Distant Horizons. Why is Distant Horizons here for Aquarius? What's the energy? Why is Distant Horizons here? The Five of Pentacles. For some of you with the devil to the four of wands, you are for a very toxic company. I feel like there's like multiple things going on that's underhanded at your job and it's all surrounding finances, stability. Somebody could be secretly struggling here. That's why they're stealing from the job. They don't want anyone to know that. Yeah, wherever you work is toxic. So you just look after yourself, Aquarius. Look after your well-being. Make sure you don't get caught up in anything. And then I'm hearing the blame game. Because I do feel like for some of you, somebody's going to try to put something on you and say you did it. But I'm hearing cameras. So for some of you, you're going to be vindicated due to some type of evidence, video footage. But yeah, just be mindful and definitely be mindful of the company you keep, who you um, befriend on the job. And then I'm hearing work and go home. So yeah, Spirit is saying, you know, go to work, do what you have to do, and then go home. Don't get too close to anyone, Aquarius. So let's pull a final message. Spirit, give me a final message for Aquarius. What's the energy? And something has to do with a teal. Somebody's teal may come up short. Give me an energy for Aquarius. What's the message? Messages for Aquarius. What's the energy? What would you like for Aquarius to know? Final message. Keep going. You're on the right path. The seeds you are planting will grow. Success is guaranteed. For some of you here, um, also, there's somebody that secretly wanted you to struggle and was waiting for this to happen. Yeah, somebody really wanted to sabotage your career, your opportunities. But I feel like whatever this person wanted for you with this distant horizons in the reverse is giving me the energy of going back to. So whatever this person desired for you, that's what's going to be taking place in their life. I feel like Spirit just wants you to keep pushing forward. You are on the right path. And you're going to start to see it. You're going to see your manifestations appear in your life, Aquarius. Just keep doing the right things. Keep planting on solid ground. And whatever you're trying to create is going to bear fruit in this time. So I feel like Spirit just wants to motivate you and encourage you that you are moving in the right direction and continue to do so. And then I'm hearing choose yourself. Continue to choose yourself. Continue to choose what's best for you. So this is your reading. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.